Come on. Shoot these two and then we're hiding. Alright, so we kind of need to start laying out where we want to put this hotel. Now the problem is this guy over there should and could prove me some sort of problem. I think it's going to go somewhere around here. out of it. Alright guys, so I think this is how we're going to do it. This is going to be sort of the, um, I guess you should call it the office. Then this will be sort of a gang walkway type area. And then this is going to be all the rooms in here. We should have fucking loads of rooms actually. Probably too many. I'm going to get the stone I've got, gear up and everything, and just start fucking, I guess, pumping it into some of these foundations. My base isn't 100% secure, but it's, it's kind of what it's got to be. I want to get this sorted. Alright, so, I've got a couple of things in mind. I want to start, obviously, doing the hotel, but what I want to do is stream that so you guys get, like, a different aspect and you get to see all that in proper action. Yeah, if I want to stream that, then I need to raid first, because I want to get a good use out of all these bloody rockets, my dudes. So I think, as opposed to doing, um, like, a, the hotel episode, then a raid, I think we'll go and jump and try and do a raid. What I'm going to do now is I'm just going to go for a little bit of a roam and see if we can find a little base to maybe flamethrower raid. I think that's got to be a thing right now. Start off with a flamethrower raid, build up to a nice big rocket raid. And also guys, if I sound a bit raspy, I do apologise, I am rather hungover. So let's go. I want to put a turret there, I think, or some shotgun turrets, just in case. And uh, maybe some, a shotgun turret here, and a turret there, that's, that's game plan. That feeling when you just do a sick flamethrower raid, and then don't actually click record. Flame raids are just, oh there's a bear over there, flame raids are just so easy as well. There's just, you just go and go and go, quietly, silently, and... Really, it's just a nice time. These walls take forever to burn, though, I must say. No shotgun traps. I think we're good. Ow, ooh, the foundations are well low. Jesus. Right, we've got literally one box. Uh, okay, Sulfur. Some of our stuff back. Yeah, we'll take that, we'll take that, we'll take that. Um, That'll do. Well done, pig. That'll do, pig. That'll do. We can raid this, but I, it's either I spam it completely. Look, there's another wood one up there by the looks of things. I either spam it, spam it completely, or I shoot from... I get on its roof and shoot from on there. Um, I don't really know, because I assume it'd be airlocked inside. I think we're going to have to get on the roof. No biggie. But it's just going to mean that people can see us a lot easier. Alright. If we skip the airlock, go for this panel maybe? The issue is that obviously these flames are big, man. A lot of people are going to be able to see us, so I'm just going to keep running back for some cover. i do it from the bottom, dudes, but because it's in the water, the water puts the flames out. As you would expect, hashtag science. Look at that, what a shot. Ferni, chest, TC. Not enough wood to build out. Standard. Right, I can climb over those furnaces. Campfire, a little bit of bear meat, never say no. Enough wood to build out, lush. Frags, nice. Bit of wood, bit of cloth. Don't need a salvage, but alright, okay. It's more than I thought it was gonna have. No, that be oh hello. That being said, I used a hell of a lot of low grade to get in here. Uh, oh, 440, alright, I'll do. We'll take it. Not a bad raid, boys. See, these little flame raids, they're just the boy. Right, let's go home. Bollocks, I've just realised I wasn't fucking recording this raid. I've just taken this door off this little 2x2. Two two. It's in a very high pop area. We're right next to the rad town there, but I fucking forgot to record. I'm sorry, boys. But we're in, and it doesn't fucking matter. Let's see what you. What have you got, Fordson? Uh, a fucking spare flamethrower, alright, bit of cloth, rope, gears, rad suit, nothing major, but nothing too bad. I really need sewing kits, so sewing kits are pretty valuable, thought I heard somebody then. 
Do I think we need furnaces? Uh, a little bit of metal. As long as we make the low grade back, and that flamethrower is full. So really, we're really, really happy. What you got? Uh, 18, okay. 300, oh, 300 sulfur, pretty nice. This one, nothing. Nada, zilcho, right. Not too bad, not too bad. Anything in the campfire? No. Ford, so you got anything on you? No, right. Boys, let's go home. Just gotta be careful. Yeah, this is next to, I don't know what that is. Is that train station? Um, what's your favorite? No, it could be sewage plant. No, it's train. Yeah, it could be sewage plant. What's your favorite red town, guys? Past the launch site. Everybody says launch site every time you talk to them, and I, I completely agree. Launch site is my favorite too, but I'd say probably dome is my like second favorite monument now. I'm not quite sure. It's so it's so nice and easy to get to and accessible. Those sort of ones like that. You can never fucking find everything in those. Okay, so now we've done all those raids, everything is looking really fucking hun hunky-dory. I don't think I actually showed you, like, the completed hotel that I'm going to be opening ready for next episode. Um, here she blows. She's looking seriously sexy. This is, like, first draft, because I don't have, I don't want to put, I haven't got, like, loads of resources to pump into it. So you've got your, sort of, my room, my area in here. So I've got to stop this out with some chests. We've got a vending machine, got a shop window so we can sell rooms to customers basically and stuff like that then you've got you come up here out here you got three downstairs rooms all rooms are equipped with a large chest a sleeping bag and a campfire as you can see I've, I've been I've gone to town here boys absolutely gone to town then you come upstairs and there are five more upstairs we've got a total of eight rooms right now and the beauty is of what we can sell this one over he these two here these are the no this one money shot this one's got a window not a great sight, just see my rock base. But this one, this is like the presidential suite. Check this out. Window, sea view. That'll go to our prime customers. But yeah, we're gonna start charging rent. It's gonna be great, I'm well fucking excited. Make sure you've got notifications on guys so you do not miss out on that video. And if you're well excited for that, please drop a like on this video so I know that you guys are really into that and I'll get on it straight away. Now, base we're gonna be raiding. And I wanna do it probably now. Yeah, sun's in the top of its sky, we're, we're Gucci. I want to raid this. This is a big fucking base, right? This is my base, like over there in the arch, but he's like filled it side to side. I think if we put four rockets on here, well, it, we'd only need like one to get through this door. Then we've got, I don't know, honeycombing and shit inside it. I, I want to see what's inside. This is obviously the guy's large furnace. So if push comes to shove, we'll just end up raiding that. But I think that's the plan. I don't know about raid base seeing as that over there is my base basically that a rock there is my base and then that's my hotel I don't know I think I'm gonna skip raid base and just go for it but I am gonna put a small stash down with the rockets in so that I've got them nice and safe been a long time since I've done a raid of this proportion this is a very very big raid for me right I want to put a turret there so if like anybody blows this wall or anything, it'll be able to shoot them. And I want to put some shotgun, a shotgun trap or two here. So if they blow this door out, oh, all right, guys, it's go time. I have never been more freaking scared in my whole entire flipping YouTube career right now. I'm knackered, I'm tired, but if I don't do this now, I've got the really massive feeling I'm gonna get raided overnight, and I really don't want that. I didn't bring a hammer. Bollocks. Come on. Come on. Shoot these two and then we're hiding. Alright. Dip the launcher. Seems quiet enough. Alright. He's got a fucking turret. Are you kidding? He's got a shotgun trap across that door. That probably means he's got one across this door as well. Lovely. Lovely. Whoa, oh shit. Is that turret not got any? It's out of ammo. Alright, okay, it's not got any bullets in. Cracking. This has got a shotgun turret. What do you do about them then? Should I shoot it? I can shoot it out, or I can try and hit it. Oh. I thought I saw a guy. I can try shooting it out. Should we see if it's. I don't think he's... It's not got any fucking bullets in it. He's not put any bullets in these things. Is this kid new to the game? Okay, that's awesome. Right. 
Fucking hell, I need to do this so I'm doing this way too slow. Okay, four rockets there, get in the main core, or shall I just shoot for the doors? Stop looking at me, turret, that's really off fucking putting. I think we try it, boys. I think we try it. Let's get the launcher and give it a go. To the beauty of when I shot the last ones, there was a gunfight going on, someone was talking about taking the heli. So really, I had a lot of cover. This time, I'm, I'm sort of just flying blind. My sweet holy Jesus, why are these so loud? Good. Right, another door, okay. Okay, I'm gonna dump the rocket launcher because I see chests. Alright, okay, what's upstairs? More chests upstairs. Oh, I just heard somebody outside. There are people outside. I need to get this loot and go. Oh, shit. Oh, I got this stone. Alright, fucking hell. There is still so much more of this base to raid, boys. I just... I think... I'm sure... Uh, we need to build up to get to that higher bit. Because I haven't even seen what's in there yet. I'm so glad I put some chests down. But they're upstairs. Bollocks. Right. Yeah, base layout, pretty much the same as it's always been. And I'm pretty sure I've been showing you as we've been going along through these episodes. But man. Alright. I've been struggling. I, I won't lie to you. I've got shit ton of components, but I've not actually crafted anything this wipe. Yet, we now have guns galore. We've got a pump. What's that? A double barrel shotgun. Revolvers. One of them for some reason. God, we've got every oh, four satchels. I didn't even see them. Right, that's sick. Okay. So we are good now then to go back, scout it out, grab our revolve, our um, rocket launcher and really go from there. But I think if we throw four rockets on here, then we'll get into a little bit more of the base. I'm unsure how many rockets I've got left, but I think I've easily got four. And if push comes to shove, I can always start crafting a few more. And I guess, yeah, we'll wait till the next day and then we'll do that. Cracking plan, lads. I've not even been recording. I've not been recording because my fucking recording keeps stopping. Right, we've just rocketed through to this. Fucking stupid idiot. Right. Stone out the fucking ass, right? We need to go really quickly. Animals everywhere. Furnaces. Alright, charcoal. I'm down. What's your name? Spare AK, fuck me. Shit, it's dark. Can't see anything. Um. Oh, are you fucking kidding me! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay. Um. Sack off charcoal. Don't care about it. 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 You can fifty-four fucking code locks. Oh, look at that scrap, though. I think that's it. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna call it on this run. Come on. Get in. Fuck. Get in. Get in. What a fucking raid, boys. Just for the flipping metal frags. Right. I need to go back. There's still so much more there to get. I can't believe it. I'm sorry if it was choppy. I'm so tired. I I did not record properly and all that. I'm, I'm normally so much more better and professional than this, guys. If you're new to the channel, I do apologise. Fuck me. We have our second AK. Thank fucking Christ, man. Look at that. Look at all those metal frags. That is... Oh, that's something glorious. I've still got a couple of extra rockets as well. But I'm just going to run back now in the night and grab what's left. Oh, I missed that gunpowder. Am I, am I foolish? You guys would have kicked off about that. I don't really need any of this stuff. I'll take it, but I don't need it. And I never want to see you in these parts again, belly go. We're done. Oh my god, my heart is absolutely pumping after that raid. I can't believe, one, that no one really tangled with us. What I think happened is they sort of saw either the turret or the shotgun traps and thought, nah, we'll leave this kid to it, which is pretty nice. Um, I think... I want to just, just, before we talk about anything else, I just want to apologise. I pride myself on being able to record pretty well and edit 
averagely. Um, and I, I'm not happy with my recording of tonight's stuff because I'm so fucking tired. I've managed to forget to record quite a lot tonight, which I never, never, never normally do. So I just want to apologise for that. If you're new around here, nor my subscribers, you know, you guys know this doesn't thing doesn't happen very often. So I just want to say sorry. I feel quite bad. So I'm sorry, guys. But before we end the episode or do anything like that, I want to break down some of the loot that we've made in tonight's video. Fuck me, things have been mad. Right, so we've got this chest. Guns are popping. This guy must just go absolutely ham on his PvP, but fuck him. Luckily, we've got him now, which is nice, so that means that we can kind of go out, and it's just, I can sell all this stuff. Shit, I can sell it all. I didn't even think. Plus, we've got four satchels, we can just go and do a random raid. I think I need to go and get my rocket launcher. No, my rocket launcher's here. I need to go and get my two extra rockets out of one of my boxes, my small stashes outside. Now, a um, little bit of crap, whatever, 579 gunpowder, some charcoal, some pipes, the, the good stuff. This boy. This is the boy. Look at those metal frags. Extra rocket launcher, extra AK, extra fucking flamethrower. I've got three of the bastards now. We've got 76 uh, high qual. We've got a load of whatever that is, a load of low grade again. And I think I put some in here, didn't I? Yeah, there's more loot in here, look. Just stuff that we've accumulated from the flamethrower raids and raiding that guy. So there's two, oh, there's my flamethrower, one of those. But it's mad. Up here is then these two are just sort of my crappy chests, which is weird because this is like one of the safest rooms of the house, but yeah, yeah, who cares? Well, each to their own. I'll give you a quick look at my actual loot downstairs as well. I really love this cave, this like arch base. It's honestly my favorite base. 100% love it. I've got two furnaces, one cooking up a little bit of sulfur. We've got a chest here, nothing major. Come into here, armored doors now, of course, because everybody needs armored doors. You look through there, this is our extra surplus stuff. This is where I held my rockets. And then this is like components and bits and pieces. I need to sort those upstairs chests out and then these are all just cooking random stuff. Because I obviously living in this arch, I haven't had a large furnace this way. So it's made it pretty tricky, but we've, we've managed, we've managed. So I just want to say guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Like I said earlier, to the next video you'll see will be a hotel. Now the beauty of doing that raid means that if I get raided, it doesn't matter. Because we can still do that hotel regardless. And to be honest, I might set the shop up as well. Should we have Tills a solo shop back as well this wipe? I know you guys love that so fucking much. So yeah, Tills a solo shop and hotel will be open for business next episode. Drop a like if you want it in, well, I don't know what day this is. I can give it you in two two days from now. So drop a like on this video if you're interested in that. Subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Make sure you've got that notification bell clicked so you don't miss out on any videos. Leave me a comment, let me know what you think. And most of all, guys, have the best day. And I will catch you all in the next episode. Hello, Ramona. I can't shake the simplest feeling beyond the ghost. We stand on the opposite shore